This video will walk through Delta's first solution for feed to length applications called feed to incremental position. We will demonstrate how an A2 servo drive can solve this without any external control and also how an HMI or PLC can be used to control timing externally. First, connect to an A2 servo drive configured for PR control using the ASDA soft software included with the drive. Open the PR editor window here. To do complete internal control, we will be using an incremental PR move followed with a jump PR. First, we set up the move in the first PR as an incremental position move. Then, we specify the desired position. Acceleration, deceleration, and delay time are all specified here in milliseconds, while target speed is specified in RPMs. Here, delay time will set our cycle rate. Next, the jump command will be defined to repeat the cycle continuously. Once this has been completed, we will download both PRs to the drive to complete our initial setup. From here, we can test the move on the drive. To change the amount of time between indexing, just change the delay time in the PR mode editor and we can see that the change has been applied. All of these parameters can be changed on the fly without the need for a PC using a PLC or an HMI for communications. You can also have an output fire within a given position window using the built-in zone compare function of the servo drive. Just set the position range you would like in P054 and P055. Then, configure a digital output to be used as your zone compare output. To demonstrate external control using I.O., we will be using the event trigger function of the drive. Click the event on off setting on the PR mode editor to open up the external event settings window. Select EV1 on to trigger a PR move. Now, a rising edge of EV1 will cause this PR to automatically be executed. Go to the PR that we just selected, and configure it to perform the desired incremental move. Finally, go to the digital I.O. control window and specify a spare digital input to become our EV1 input. At this point, we are ready to demonstrate control of the drive via a digital input. You can also use a Modbus command from an HMI or a PLC rather than a digital input to trigger this PR move. Thanks to the innovative controls of the PR mode on Delta's A2 servo drives, we could solve a feed to length application in a variety of ways, simply and easily. For more information, please contact Delta's Industrial Automation Hotline.